Grant, are you ready? The spookiness. The spookiness, Grant. Dude. The spookiness. I am not okay with this at all. Well, look at this guy. Look at his face. Yeah, it looks fucking scary. Is look that Baraka his... from Mortal Kombat? It's Baraka. It's the Baraka game. Yeah, yeah. I don't want to play this. This is the asylum. We play spooky games at the asylum. Are we in in England where they don't have dental hygiene? That's really scary. That's really the scariest <laughs> part. By the way, I, I'm Jeff. I'm Grant. Hey, Grant. It's been a while. And this guy is needing floss. Yeah. Let's, uh, so let's see what's going out. Oh, shit. New climbers log. All right. Is this just a, a game about climbing? Uh, always be climbing, ABC. ABC, yeah, yeah, always be climbing. Uh, I, I don't know. Uh, this is a Wii game. Uh, I was telling you before that there's like there's a handful of horror Wii games that like because I didn't ever have a Wii, I never got a chance to play. And every year it's like I go searching around for weird games that nobody's ever heard of, and this was one of them. So this may be the same people that made Saints Row for fuck's sake. What's it called? Cursed Child. Cursed play. Mountain. Curse Mountain. My brother. This is Cliffhanger with Zombies, I think. <laughs> I, is it? Yeah. Best. That's Sylvester Stallone. He sounds like uh, uh, what, Jason Statham. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, oh, Jason Statham, I'm climbing a mountain. Is that what, he, is that what Jason Statham sounds like? Man, they went all out on the animation here. <laughs> how well, you could, how you can, can you afford this with like a, you know, a cheap video oh, game budget? Oh, shit. Okay. Uh, all right. So here we are. We're climbing a mountain. Well, oh, <laughs> I hope this is all that happens. I hope we spend a half hour just climbing, just a climbing up a mountain. Well, so okay, uh, the all the radio shit. Here's, whoa, it's it, coming through the speaker on my Wii Uh All right, hit A to climb the mountain. <gasps> there Here we go. go. All right, we're doing it. Yeah. Oh, we climb the mountain. Man, I'm I'm scared. I'm scared already, Grant. Of, of I don't, I, the mountain. I don't like heights. I mean, actually, that's not true. I don't care about heights. I'm I'm scared of um, that dude's teeth again. <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, of cold weather. Ugh. Really? Is that where you uh, live in Texas? I just, I just feel like uh, your toes are going to fall off at a certain point when you go too high. Well, you just you get like boots or something. You could get by like. Frank. To make <laughs> okay, <laughs> all right. A famous expedition organizer. Uh huh. Bennett climbed with Hillary, Bishop, Mesner, Wait. And most of the other gods of the mountaineering world. Hillary Clinton? This is a god of the mountaineering I'm world, Grant. Most people don't know that. Trying to make climbing great again. <laughs> that was our goal. I think that's what we need to do. But she oh. went crazy, so we had to Time lock to her up. <laughs> Hashtag. <laughs> Uh, that's how we should we should elect officials is they all have to climb the the giant mountain and then yeah okay it's, and then whoever survives the, the george Costanza rules the, the feats of strength yep yep <laughs> i feel like i'm doing the exact same thing i'm just running up this little ledge on the left and then a turn in and then i'm running up here did you die I, maybe you fell and died oh shit it's like a like a groundhog day except you die on the mountain over and over again uh oh uh -oh. these specs here uh oh you know jeff uh you had me whoa whoa what that one's got a weird wiggly body oh shit are they zombies yes. mountain zombies yes stone people call, fa following you oh shit not already acclimatized okay so, once again, acclimatized the isn't the word acclimated uh, Why do you say acclimatize? Dude, I, I wouldn't do it. You're going to get somebody who climbs for a living who's going to be like, actually, Grant. Uh, who's acclimatized? Oh, shit. Okay. I feel like we haven't found out much of anything. Like, oh, this hey, guy's... we're about to start the game. Yeah. <laughs> five five minutes in. Let's do this. Let's go. Um, uh, I feel like, what, what do we know so far? The One friend tried to climb the mountain. The bear went over the mountain to yeah. see what he could see. I, okay. wasn't, I wasn't paying attention. Shadows in Lahondo. You misspelled Lando. Yeah. Uh, guys. <laughs> no. <laughs> Shadows of Lando. Why is there a uh, like a um, uh, like a ship? A ship, uh, a ship turner. No, like what is the thing they... The a wheel? steering wheel. Yeah. Oh, now you've got... We could have taken a uh, fucking truck this whole time? Nope. It disappeared. Oh, shit. Okay. This is a pretty uh, scary game. You saw the you saw Barack at the beginning. There's got to be something going on here. So Jeff, I didn't just spin the wheel of random Wii games and go, mm, yeah, yeah, okay. The the Mariner's wheel. He didn't spin that weird that Mariner's right. wheel of climbing. Oh shit! I think we're going to fucking uh, what's that place that Iron Fist comes from? Uh, Liu Kang. Liu Kang. Yeah, we're going to Liu Kang. Yeah, <laughs> that's where he comes from, folks. Look it up. 
He's the fucking oh, immortal oh, iron guy yeah. from Liu Kang. Yeah. <laughs> iron dude. Streets bare. Okay. I had to bribe a truck driver to bring me here. And no amount hmm. of money could persuade him to actually enter the city. Not even twelve dollars. So Over there, that's a lot of money. Make it harder for me to find my brother. We heard it was the PF Changs closed. Now, they all yeah, moved yeah. out. On the edge of a deserted city. Mm. Okay. Constipation. Answers, and without a clue how to find Edward Bennett's house. All right. So situation normal, I guess. Oh man. <laughs> so you had me come over a couple weeks ago to play a game. Yeah. Um, oh, okay. Find Edward Bennett's house. I feel it was scarier than this. Uh, the game is about to save your progress. Don't reset. Oh, your progress oh, might not save. You had me play a couple weeks ago. Which one? Uh, the one that we didn't use. Oh, Transcendence? Transference? Transference? The, yeah, the VR one that was boring <laughs> as shit. It was scarier than this. <laughs> so sad. The water is dead as everything else. How, how do you know that? If, if this doesn't work out, you should find that transference one or whatever. Oh, just put that up put instead? That up. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, look, nothing happens. Ooh. You know what uh, we should whoa. spend time making a scary game about? What's going on? Climbing Even the, the mountain and like reading some guy's Anne Frank diary. <laughs> <laughs> Even the birds are dying. Can I go in here? Where am I supposed to go? Grant, do you see anything? I see nothing. Is there wait, what about this like shop over here? Is it like a restaurant or yeah. like a, a bar? Go to the bodega. Uh a bodega? Nope. Get some chips. What about this box? There's gotta be a zombie around here somewhere. Get some crisps. So we, uh, so if this one turns out to be a dud, then that means that we probably played all of the scary Wii games that exist. <laughs> we played Silent Hill, we played Calling, we tried playing this. Oh, How about here we go. Here we go. Uh Oh shit! What? Oh no! It's what I found in that cell was an eerie light glowing. Can I? Is it a crystal? Oh, uh, is that what? Uh! Come on, guys! Show us the. Quit doing these cuts. It oh. was an ice axe. The handle of the axe is wrapped with a distinctive piece of colorful cloth. It belonged to Frank Simmons. Are they fucking kidding us? Oh. Wait, is that a dead body in there? Uh. Swing the axe to break what things. What was that big intense moment for showing an ice axe? That was like uh, he was flashing back. He was using his, his powers. Urgh. What okay. was that, that uh, lame game where you like walk around the basement where there's monsters of this like big mansion? Um, Resident and Evil? They made a Christian Slater movie after it. It was a video Alone game. Alone in the Dark? Alone in the Dark. We actually played that, uh, played the original this year. This reminds me of Alone in the Dark. Urgh. Urgh. Oh no, Alone in the Dark is much more action packed than this. <laughs> uh, press to open your backpack. All right. Well, we're we're like 2 minutes in here. Let's let's figure it out. Let's see. Books. We are 10 minutes in, sure. my friend. I was hoping you wouldn't look at the big numbers that I had up there. <laughs> uh, incense sticks. Oh damn, let's let's burn some of those. Oh, shit. The Lando Chronicles. Get some incense going. Yeah. Play a little bit of Alanis uh, here. <laughs> and, uh, Bennett prepared his axe of special mantras to help him ascend to the upper reaches of Chorizo. He told me to take it to the base camp, but ghosts surrounded me. Oh, shit. I wish we could see some. They flooded the city and forced me to run. The axe helped me make it this far, but my luck has run out. Frank must be doomed. I fear he's also angered the goddess. And there's no escaping the wrath of Paul and Lamb Blam Blam Theoretical blow. ghosts All followed right. me. Y yep. <laughs> Uh, is there, can I, what am I, nope, okay. Try and go back down to that, uh, dead body. You think that's. That was, that's... like, the most interesting thing we saw. Okay, sure. It was the scariest thing so far. <laughs> Except for those little wobbly, uh, rock body people. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we need to find some of those. This, this guy? Yeah. Man, I can't, like, get in here. Like, uh, I can swing the. Is that Frank, you think? Uh, I think it's the, the guy with the. Okay, well, okay, we maybe you need to leave this room now that you got the ice pick. Bust shit up, right? Yeah. Go back out here and just bust this town to pieces. Bust it makes you feel good. Uh, it, it really does. Uh, Ew. I, now I know what you mean by that. <laughs> uh, okay. Do you remember uh, when Corn Nuts uh, had that radio ad called Bust a Nut? No. Bust a Nut. Bust a Nut. No, come I on, don't. Come on and bust a nut. Okay, what, if, what, are, nuts. what am I supposed like, to be doing? Do they know what that means? What am I supposed to be doing here, Grant? Dude, I don't know. Find another door down this way. Okay. Oh, there's a door right there. Here's a door. I don't. Nope. Nope, that doesn't do anything. We went down there. That was where that thing was. What thing? The, no, you went down the other one to the left, right? Uh, this is new. 
All oh, right. Well, this is where we Hop came the from. Truck. But it's the running. driver has disappeared. Hey, look. Okay. Yeah, look at that shit. All right. All right. You looked at it. So what? What? What can we use the? We've got a pickaxe now. We could bust shit up with the pickaxe. Turn right. Okay. I thought. Yeah, I thought we went down here. That was a little dead end, right? Yep. This is where the even the crows oh. are dying. But you just busted that. Yeah. Even the birds are dying. Even the birds are dying. Okay. That door, you can't do anything. Uh, go back to the left. Over here? No, you passed. Yeah, uh, that way. And to the left. Okay. Right now. Okay. And then go turn. This this door? No. Uh, go around the corner here. To okay. The uh-huh. This little AC unit. No, nothing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, like it's that. a haunted AC unit. That is a nice looking Ooh. AC unit. We should appreciate it where, where you can find AC <laughs> units here. Oh, man. Okay, well, you know what? Uh, can you climb up that? What? The house? Or, like, here? Can you here? look up or go through that window right there? No, I got I got one button, and it hit, hit stuff with the uh, pickaxe. Did we miss something in this door over here? Uh, yes. That's our only option. I mean... The only uh, option is that we missed something. Wait, oh, wait. How about this big shiny thing on the ground? Oh, yeah. What's that? It's a rusty key. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> this always happens to me. <laughs> I was like going to run around for 12 minutes not knowing where anything is up on top of this mountain. Uh, okay. It's all good. Hold and use it to look around. I don't know why this thing has to use the dumb weave mode. Like none of these controls. Oh, shit. The smoke monster. Don't Fuck. Look at this. I do. Let's follow it. Let's see where it's going. Oh, God. Oh. It's going to take and reveal your deep inner secrets and then smash you against a wall. All the... It was the ghost of desaturation. Uh, you know what the smoke monster should have been? I don't even know what it actually was. Uh, but It was a protector of the island. It was a mystical island, and it didn't... <laughs> Whatever. You've been in my house for ten minutes, and it's time to bring up Lost. Ah! Time to bring up Lost. Okay. What's, what's going on with this? So my theory was that the island should have been like this this nexus point between a bunch of multi uh, like a multidimensional uh, nexus point like for all these worlds, right? Right. And uh, they all reconvene in this one island, and this island kind of holds the uh, multiverse together. Whatever. Okay. Whoa. And I thought that the um, the smoke monster should therefore have been like some sort of like um, editorial cleaning process uh -huh. thing that goes in like checks where people are and if they belong the in this system thing? or not or if they've become a problem and are impure or they're corrupt or whatever they uh, kind of wipe them out okay kill them ah, oh, oh wait on. whoa what happened i got it's really enough <laughs> grant you looked away from the screen like did something the, scary happen there's just like a giant monster face that i have a bad <laughs> which is a good habit actually yeah when i'm talking to someone i want to look at them don't, I was looking don't, at you. don't look don't look you got to look Fine, at the screen I'll, I'll look at this game was it super scary uh, sort of scary it was more of a startling What's well, that strange shape on the floor? I, I mean, I notice a wetness in your pants. Like I mean, you, you know, pissed yourself. Yeah. But then again, you could have just been busting. I, like you, I had a. a you a, love busting, you said. My testicles were very dry. They were chafing. I just needed to, you know, I just needed to get a little, you know, you know how it goes. I don't. What's going on? Can you go into more more detail? <laughs> no. no <laughs> that's, slowly. That's <laughs> speak slowly. Um, so I took my testicles in my hand. You have three incense sticks. My climbing partner knew what was going on. What down. the fuck is even going on in this game? <laughs> I like spent $10 on this game and got it ordered off of Amazon and you shit. spent 10 bucks on this for what? Uh. Oh, shit. <laughs> that, was, that was exciting right there. Yeah, yeah, it definitely Nathan was. Drake here. Yep. Look at the jumping buildings. <laughs> Jeff, no, we have we, to. We only been, we're only 15 minutes in. We Jeff, can totally we pull the gotta record on keep this. going. We gotta play this through. Really? I want this to be the lamest one game that I, anyone's I, ever I, had to endure. I, it, I was told it was a horror <laughs> game. <laughs> I didn't. Uh, I love that you just tried to quit on it. No, fuck that. We are. No. What, look at that dummy. <laughs> <laughs> the startling, oh, the goosebumps cover. Oh my god! I'm gonna have to start playing all these games before we play these games. <laughs> you used to do some little uh, QC. Well, I used to play new games when they came out because they were new games and they and seemed you just interesting. Wanted to play them. Right, but like, you know, 
when I was like, best horror games for the Wii, this is like the third or fourth one that came up. And uh, so far, <laughs> this game is so great. It's we're so just scary. We're just running it's around, it. vandalizing this Himalayan city that doesn't have any people in it. I love that you were like me already embarrassed. You're just like, oh. I am embarrassed. I, I wanted to, to be spookier for fuck's sake. <gasps> oh, man. Jeff, you should make I, a game. Uh, you can make this game. I can make this game. <laughs> be like, I'll just I'll make it a text adventure. It's called Everything Was Boring and Nothing <laughs> Happened. Ooh. What's the red meter over on the side? It's my health. I got scared real bad and it went down. Just Wait, do we go of, in a big circle out of fear? Yeah. Okay. I mean, like that would make more sense if there were more like ghosts. But the the world is so idiotically stupid looking that I can't tell where anything is. Yeah. Oh, is that a? Okay, I got another key. And is that rotting human? It looks like a dead person. Yeah. Hit him with the stick. No. Nope. Okay. Uh, I just... That the oh. What is that? That's scary. No, it's... Is it? Where? Where is it? I don't know. Did his health go down? Was he scared is it in the, enough for his health to Is go it down? in here? I don't understand. What was that? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Such a random assortment of bullshit. What <laughs> country did this game come from? America. This is a U.S. made video game. Dude, okay. The hold Japanese on. know how to make a scary game. This game is a definitely. Uh, this is called Cursed Mountain. Cursed Mountain. Have you read up on this? I have not. Do you mind if I pull up some notes on you this? Do, I would. If no, you want to play I'm a video, by it. say goodbye to Chomolozo. A girl says goodbye to the valley forever. Cursed Mountain. Yep. It's a survival game. Uh huh. Here's a little Wikipedia on this. It's a survival horror action adventure video game for the Wii, developed by Sproing Interactive Media in collaboration and distributed. Okay, blah, 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 blah. blah. Deep Silver, yep. The game focuses on a mountaineer searching for his lost brother in the Himalayas. Yep. Um, there's, it's there's... available to download. It was made in 2010. Uh huh. Oh, I mean, uh oh. Yeah. Wait, is something going to happen? It's more of these ghost monsters. Oh shit! That okay, guy's like, it looks like he's rollerblading toward you. <laughs> what am I? What am I even he looking at? He found somewhere to buy rollerblades. Oh. Hallucinating. Uh, it's the nun. Oh, it's he's, it's, it's he, a monk. He's one of the Jabberwockies. They're about to the dance battle you. Like a ritual. The ghost shrinks, as if it's in pain. It's gone. Oh, uh, <laughs> it's time to yawn. <laughs> what is real? <gasps> what? Am I... Hel you am I... The, you know what? what okay. Your like, uh, I don't even understand what I'm looking at. Is this happening? Is he flashing back? Is it part of the game? Is it... Oh, that guy was for real. You must learn about the third eye, the gateway to higher consciousness. You must learn about the third eye. <laughs> Dude, I said it already! <laughs> <laughs> this game is so terrible! I love that they put in the... The, the text and then he reads it so slowly. Each of us has a third eye. Well, is this just gonna make the game better? Is it when it can open up my third eye? Try now. Try hard. You can do this. You can probably just be enlightened. Hold down the C button to use the third eye. What? It works. What is so it? In this game, combat primarily consists of encounters with angry souls of monks and climbers who've been trapped in Bardo. Uh-huh. Spiritual realm in between this life and the next. The player must stun the enemies and make gestures with the Wii moat uh -huh. to free their souls. Okay, let's do it. Let's is that, do it. Should I keep doing it? Aim at the shrine with... Oh, 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 look. Okay, so here I'm using the Wii moat. Uh -huh. Press A to rip the symbol out of the shrine. Perfect. Just you fucking... Yeah! Did I do it? I don't think so. Now perform the complete ritual. Purify the Lock shrine. on target. Okay, do that. Uh-huh. Wait a minute! You do all that, then he just walks up and you can now ignite incense sticks at the shrine of Sangai Menla to heal you yourself. Just get, you just got the I got my health the, back. The soul stone or something? Is that what's going on? Oh, wait a minute, where'd the fucking monk go? Yeah, what? Where what is what? He was all in your mind. Oh no! Ooh. Ghost monks! Okay. Oh, maybe so, we'll find this. Uh, well, we can at least we can look into the spirit world now. I think this is interesting. Curse Mountain uh, was a collaborative development by 16 companies, 236 people, uh -huh. in 17 unique locations in 14 countries. Oh shit! Wait, hold on. So I have to like 
I'd like make this symbol. Why does this have such a pretty high score? Like across different game boards. The stars bound by it. You need to find the symbol. Well, to see, that's why I bought it. Was because when I looked out in the world, it had a pretty good reputation. Like and now it's, it's possible that this might just be like the old Rage Select curse of like, I want something to happen and it takes like 45 minutes for anything to happen because this is a horror game. Um, that as That is a thing that has happened many times before. Yeah. Um, so I'm trying, but it's just like, it's not really graphically interesting. No. The story setup has been dull. The voice acting is kind of poo-poo. Uh, so, okay, so it, like it told me that like what do I have to like it find seems this symbol? Corny. And why do I give a fuck about these Maddening Brothers? How about this guy just die as well? Find something to increase the power of the ice axe. Okay. Like what? What would increase the power of the ice axe? Adamantium. <laughs> the Weapon I, X program, obviously. Yeah. <laughs> um, I've got a shitload of incense. Man, I mean, if, if if you could just wrap some incense around that ice axe, I think you'll be good to go. <laughs> you think that'll be uh, like we actually went like I, I was saying before that we went back and played the first Alone in the Dark game, and within the first five minutes of that game, a fucking monster dog with weird shoes comes out. And like you have Jeez. to, you have to punch it to death. Are those British knights? Uh, <laughs> what are weird shoes? No, uh, they look like like Mickey shoes. They're like uh, like Mickey oh. Mouse's shoes. They're like very very dapper. Nice. Uh, okay, so we can look into the spirit worlds. Now we have to go all the way back to the beginning and check every place that we just went, except in the spirit world, Grant. So, all right, are, I are have you, a serious question. Tell me about it. Um, adamantium and vibranium. Which one is uh, harder? Is vibranium <clears throat> like the hardest one? Metal. I thought adamantium was harder than vibranium. I think, vib okay, you know what? I think that vibranium is a later thing than adamantium because, like, Captain America Shield was made out of adamantium in the comics, I believe, right? No, I thought it was vibranium because it absorbs all shock. Like, vibranium oh, absorbs oh, shock. Oh, this guy. What's going on with him? Oh. Could fucking, maybe we can shoot at a... Let's go chat with Shake... Him. And thing to shake off the ghost. Okay. I don't think he's like oh. near you yet. Well, how do we let him? Let him grab you and then shake. Him. Can't tell anymore. Is he? Is he? Is he shaking with fear? No. Walk into him first, so oh. he grabs you. Why? Uh, then you can shake him off. Like Taylor Swift. I'm so scared. I did it. I did it, Grant. I shook it off. Do you think if uh, you were just by yourself and uh, this would be scary? Like in the real world? Yeah. Uh, you playing this game or like in being in this situation? Dude. Uh, oh, Playing hey. this game. Oh. <laughs> being in this situation. Oh, shit. Yeah, that'd be crazy scary. Yeah. What the fuck are you doing in this weird oh. asshole? Uh, I'm trying Abandoned to find my... Town? my oh, look, we can, attack we can fight the ghost now. All right. We can slam down on the... Something's finally happening. Yeah, we'll slam down on the ghost with the, my fucking pickaxe. And red lightning comes from them. Gone. And I got more incense sticks. Was it the axe? No, dude, it was you. You believed in yourself. <laughs> That's right. It was in you. You don't need healing. Okay. So am I supposed to be, like, collecting a certain number of... Ghosts? Uh, souls? Ghost souls or something to power up? Ah! Uh, oh, right. This place. You need to collect them and put them in your uh, oh. fire station, I think. Okay, so... Oh, here we go. We got another one of these. What the heck? Yeah. Man, you are on point with your, your Wii motions. Oh, shit. It's... I don't, I don't know what it is. Uh, Hi? Is it Baraka? Is it Baraka? From the... Oh! Oh, it's Vagina Eyes. Ooh. Old Vagina Eyes. <laughs> Old HR Giger. Vaginas for eyes and dicks for a mouth. Uh, wait, what do I do? Oh, wait, look, that's the symbol. Oh, yeah. That's the symbol that we need to to open the... Wait, oh, was there something to pick up here? Take. Ah, what? Oh, you're, you're getting... Oh, it's the, am, it's the mountain from Game of Thrones. I wait, mountain. This ritual flaying knife with the curved and hooked blade symbolizes cutting through obstacles. Okay. Quality of dagger, yeah. right? Oh, shit. And I put it on my... I put it on the pick because, you know... Now you have it stronger, dude. Does that That's mean that I can... Mean. The symbol's been broken. The door can now be opened. Okay. Well... What door? The the one uh, to our brother's place, right? 
Like we were trying to find oh, out how to cell? break the symbol. No, there was like a big house up here. Oh yeah, yeah. And it was like I can't get in there because of the weird symbol that's blocking the door. And now we've got the circle on top of our axe, and it makes the symbol go away yeah. or something. Uh, it's pretty obvious science, I think. Hey, I, you know what? It's it's growing on me a little bit. This it, game. A, a little bit. A little bit. Not a lot. Yeah, you gonna play it all the way through as soon as I leave? Oh fuck no. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna take it out, put it in a box, and never play it ever again. In fact, if somebody wants this piece of shit, I'd almost be willing to send Wait, it to them. You bought this on C D? Yeah, I mean I didn't buy it <laughs> by digital download. It was oh. like it was like four dollars on Amazon. I got Prime, I got free shipping and shit, right? Like Um Okay. In fact I, the copy I got was new. It was like sealed in the package. I mean, given all the other games that uh, we've seen this week, yeah, uh, this is the scariest. You think so? And well, most well made. Grant got the the scariest of them all. You this guys, is the best. best. Uh oh, hold C D use the third eye. Hurt the ghost with B. Oh shit! I can shoot lasers from this motherfucker now. Also, <laughs> what? Okay, I take it back. Best it's game an I've ever played. Proton pack. Man. Best game I've ever played is like Ghostbusters, but in the Himalayas. <laughs> Boom! <laughs> but where to? You can't kill a ghost. It's already dead. Oh, no. All right. Kill a ghost. Things are things are heating up. Dead. So what happened to it? Maybe. Voice acting is just atrocious. Though. <laughs> <laughs> Freeze, ghost! Badab, chow, chip, chow, 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 chow. Okay. Kind of red. Um. Wait, why is it all like lightning and shit? Like shooting from his his rod. Yeah, why is this rod got all that lightning coming out of it? Now, like when it got done shooting it, it's like there's still a bunch of lightning coming off of it. Oh, I think it's just kind of a little razzed up right now. Oh, uh, okay. It's got to calm down. <laughs> Do some breathing exercises. A little refractory you know, period. Yeah. Uh, yeah. You know. Uh, okay. Well, about in here. Yeah. Uh, ghosts? Are there any ghosts in here? I want to blast another one. Nope. Okay. Nope. Um. So, what do you think uh, is going to be the end goal of this? Just finding his brother and finding out that his brother is like some big ghost and he has to kill his brother? Nope. I'd be willing to bet that there's an ancient evil on this mountain that was awakened and that his brother was possessed and that the uh, monk will lead you to the powers that you need to purify this holy city and that your brother is uh, the actual end boss and he's possessed by the demon spirit that lives inside of the mountain that awakes every 500 years. Holy shit. That's exactly the synopsis <laughs> on Wikipedia. <laughs> did you? What the? Okay, Jeff, did you make this game? This no, it. I didn't. Did you actually design this it's game a while back? No, I didn't. I didn't do it. To stop them. It's not that. Like it's uh, That was just some shit I made up. <laughs> I bet you're actually pretty close, and if I really gave a damn, I'd read this <laughs> plot synopsis that they actually have on here. Oh, my. That guy's it, mustache is the scariest thing. It, you know what the, the main Full thing mustached is? Full mustached Hitler. Artifact. Very powerful indeed. I just, I know that we're, we're not the best at paying attention, but like I just don't understand what's going on here. Oh, okay. Well, maybe your brother's still alive, and then you got to defeat the evil that's on the mountain or whatever to do the thing. This kind of reminds me of that uh, Azura's Wrath game you made me play. Dude, Azura's Wrath is a hundred times better than this game. You were punching Buddhas into outer space in like the first four seconds of that game. Sure, I only mean in these like weird cutscene narratives yes. that it keeps deviating to. That aspect reminds me of it. Um, nothing else. <laughs> because I agree. I'm like, there's no space Buddhas at all in this game. <laughs> bonkers awesome. Oh, this is just this is stupid. <laughs> I don't. I don't know. They, they. Okay. Listen. I'm. I'm giving it. I'm giving it a little bit of the benefit of the doubt of saying like, uh, you know, it's. I think you called it, man. It's like, kind of Resident Evil meets Ghostbusters, like in a Himalayan mountain place, right? You're gonna have resources. You're gonna be going around. You're gonna be smacking on some ghosts. Um. I don't know. Like the Wii was a, an interesting platform because you've got the the whole like use your one hand for motion, right? Yeah. Um. So I got to find something of Frank's in order to. So people were just trying to crank out some games that could fit with this, and this was 2010. I think it was 2009, actually. Oh. Uh, okay, that changes it. But uh, yeah, I don't know. Um, okay. Oh shit! I don't know how to. Oh wait, I don't know how to get through that one. That's a different symbol. Okay, break the symbol. 
Break do, it. Do, hold on. Can you back up, or are you just going to turn all the way? Okay, you can only turn all the way around. <laughs> then turn all the way around this way. All right, blast on it. Yeah, motherfucker. Did I do it? You did it. Oh, cool. Easy peasy. Yeah, I think the actual movie cliffhanger is more scary than this. Dude, that <laughs> movie is super scary. It's yeah. got such a great intro. Yep. They're like hanging on that, that big wire between two mountains or whatever. Yeah, the soundtrack to that movie is kind of intense. Who's the uh, bad guy in Cliffhanger? Oh, uh, it's not Lithgow, is it? Oh, I think it is Lithgow. Okay, I'm not I'm not doing I'm not doing that. You know what? That part. I also have a phone for that. <laughs> Grant's new job is look up shit we don't know on Wikipedia. Oh, shit, I got a bell. Oh. Uh, it is John Lithgow. Yep. A small bell to summon. A small bell belonging to Frank Simmons. Okay. So. Michael Rooker's in it. Wait a minute. That guy was. See, this is the other problem that I'm having, Grant. I can't tell who's, like, alive and who's, like, a spirit person in this game. Um. Uh, like, the guy with the mustache, he was actually there in that room, in, like, reality. But then when we're done talking to him, he he disappeared from the room. Right. Uh, but we're supposed to actually be bringing him stuff. Uh-oh. Oh, oh that's no. That's us. Yeah, that's why I got this game, because that guy kind of looks like me if it's I It's more hair. like Pigpen. Like, it's just a bunch of stinky ghosts. Oh, motherfucker, you're in for it now. Eat fucking proton pack. Oh, shit. He's, bu he's gently weaving from side to side, Grant. <laughs> I can't get at him. Oh, God. Oh, it's so hard to use motion controls. Shoot him. Uh -oh. Oh, he's there. Oh, super slow. Oh, here we go. Ah yeah, you suck it now, you <laughs> jerk. Woo! Bustin'. Oh, rip that fucking shit out of you. There you go. You did it. Disappear into red sperms, why don't you? Oh, weird. He did it. Banishing it goes to the compassion ritual. Helps to heal you when hurt. Was yeah. that the compassion ritual? It looks super compassionate. <laughs> oh, you motherfucker! <laughs> Run gonna, in hell, you shit! Just gonna shoot some uh, lightning bolts into your body yeah. with love and compassion. And then rip your soul out of your chest. With love. I care about you! <laughs> Die! It's so dark, too. It's just like, ah, what? Uh, here we go. Skablamsies! Oh, yeah. See, the, these movements aren't scary. They're kind of silly. Yeah, there's actually there's a game called Fatal Frame that's like a hundred times better than this this particular um, uh, conception because you use a camera. Under these coasts are real, and your whole worldview just got knocked into a hat. Yeah, this is this is the some kind of high altitude hallucination. This is where the game falls down. Is is this is too abstract for me? I don't understand where the fuck it's where, where it is, what it's doing. So. I feel like they they probably storyboarded this with like envisioning some better story ah. storytelling ah. Um, cut sequences. Yeah, and then they're like, oh, we don't have the budget. Let's just use our storyboards. <laughs> <laughs> That'll suffice. We'll just, we just need to get this game out. We've used 238 people over 14 <laughs> countries trying to get this done. We just need to wrap this shit up. And then this was was what we got. Facing the yo 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 genie yogi yo genie yo yo genie yes yo genie <laughs> climb his log okay feet. wait are we approaching the Star Trek climb his log but someone wait so we left here. the maybe someone who knows how to like I'm controlling him now like we left maybe that news about that huge town <laughs> and now we went to the tiny village. This is a different point in his life. Oh. Maybe. Does he still have the... No, dude. He's got, like, the fucking... <laughs> he's got the goddamn proton powers. he got the proton pick. Um, I guess he decided he's, he's done there. He, he got all he needed. Okay. Maybe this game works better if you're, like, scared of heights or something, right? Or maybe if you're, like, really stoned. Oh, dude. That's what we didn't do. I know we forgot something. We forgot the weed. Son of a bitch. All right. Well... Oh, there's like a zebra something it's blocking like a, the a path. A ripple in the Matrix. Yeah. Oh, I should go watch it. We should watch the Matrix instead of playing this game. <laughs> there's a lot of things we should have done instead We should of this get, get some tacos and then watch the Matrix. Oh, man. Sounds like a good idea. But that doesn't mean that you guys wasted your time watching us play this game. 
Yeah. You didn't. You did a good job. That's true. This was of value. You yeah. deserve tacos in the Matrix. <gasps> like, oh, you get yourself some tacos and some Matrix. Ignorance is bliss. Those tacos are good. Yeah. Oh. Padme. Manny Petties from Padme. <laughs> Natalie Portman's giving out, <coughs> uh, giving out some nail buffs. Nice. All right. You know what? I think we've, uh, I think we've, we've done enough. I, I got a good sense of this game. I'm glad that we didn't quit early on. We, <laughs> we plowed through and realized this is game of the year. Uh, yeah, game of the year. Fuck Red Dead Redemption Two. Uh, <laughs> you and Jason should just play this. The we cursed mountain from 2009 is obviously the 2018 game of the year. Locked in, y'all. Locked in, 100. <laughs> percent uh, We did it. Yep, we figured it out. We I bet you. Rage like might be the only one who rated it that way. But. I bet you didn't even know that a 2009 game could be the 2018 game of the year. So it's, uh, it's uh, you know just didn't it, it, I didn't see it coming either to be honest. So uh, do you hand out rages? No. Well, you should I, hand out rages for uh, uh, awards. I mean, I there is a thing that those words. Let's just not go into what that means. Yeah, uh, are you handing out rages? Yeah, handing out rages. Yeah, I think there's a neighborhood restraining order. No, 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 no. They're always consensual. Consensual rages. Uh, I don't know why they keep giving me a million incenses. I don't need any of them for anything. Anyway, thanks, everybody, for watching. Hit the like and subscribe button. Um, let's see. Patreon.com forward slash rage select. Grant, why don't you tell the people where they can find you on the internet? Uh, you guys can find me right here on this video. It's the only thing it's I've only ever done. Yep. He's never done anything else on the internet. I have no other internet. No, like not a TV about. guy or a, 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 a beer man or any of that stuff. I am part of the beer men. <laughs> okay. And the TV guys. And the TV guys. <laughs> Go check them out. <laughs> All right. Uh, thanks, everybody, for watching. We'll be back tomorrow on The Asylum with another spooky video. Eat shit, ghost. Fuck you, ghost. And your dumb ghost mom. Yeah, right in the dick. She's a ghost biaf.